It's a city renowned by many people for this. But within and around Auckland there are still some spots for nature. Places like the Botanical Gardens in Manuera and nearby Totara Park, the location for this year's BioBlitz. BioBlitz is a 24 hour race against time to find as many species of plants, fungi, insects and other animals as possible. The public helps scientists from a range of organisations gather an inventory of the native, introduced, pest and rare species seen. This provides valuable information to share with the public and assist the scientists' work. And staff from the organisers Landcare Research, the Auckland Council and the Manukau Beautification Trust were always nearby to lend a hand and offer advice. For Stanley Belgard of Landcare Research, the event was a unique opportunity to talk with people of all ages about the deadly Kauri dieback disease. The simple messages we're teaching around hygiene, around awareness for tracks and staying on tracks and staying on boardwalks and following advice not only manages diseases but also has other, other uh, benefits for the environment. It also allows the public to engage with scientists and learn more about the different fauna, flora and fungi in a city's reserves and remnants of native bush. BioBlitz kicked off with a special morning set aside for local school children, a somewhat frantic but highly successful way to begin the event. There's lots of enthusiasm in the kids, lots of questions, lots of new knowledge we hope they're getting and uh, sort of fascination with what we're showing them. But um, yeah, it's a pretty dynamic day. Walks, talks and all other events were highly popular and when day turned to night the work didn't stop. Robert Hawes moth collecting was popular, so too Grace Hall's spider walks. Spider? Yeah. So it's just a good way of catching little things that you can't usually see that hide underneath the leaves. The final total was announced by the bug man Rude Kleinpast. Smile. There were 504 species of insects, spiders and other invertebrates, 293 species of fungi, 36 species of birds, fish and other invertebrates. 418 species of plants and altogether this was a total of 1,251. Congratulations to everyone who took part.